All right, so it's time for us to check out the brand new Fizz Transforming Angel Frieza at rainbow status and also with max link levels. Now on paper, this guy does seem like he might be the new best TUR in the entire game, even over tech transforming Gohan, over STR Cooler, Fizz Vegito Blue, and so on and so forth. But of course, before we officially Given that title, we do have to see how well he performs here. So without further ado, let's jump in here and uh, see what he's all about. Okay, so on the first rotation, he's linked up with the STR cooler. He's got a second cooler here for support. And we're starting off with 121,000 defense, which is pretty impressive, but it's not like the craziest thing I've seen. Although, keep in mind, he does actually get an additional 50% attack and defense for five turns after taking an attack. So his defense should be quite a bit higher after he gets hit. And also he's raising defense every single time. He supers as final form Frieza. So uh, defense really shouldn't be too much of an issue for him. And one other thing to note before we attack is that his active skill to transform into golden Frieza is already available, right? So that's amazing. That's like the best possible condition for a transformation for an active skill because you literally don't have to do anything right there's no hp restriction there's no turn restriction there's no enemy restriction there's no ally restriction there's literally nothing you got to do you can pop that immediately which is something that really stood out to me when i first saw the details on paper i was like this dude is so uh what's the word flexible he's versatile like you can really use him on any event and he'll be fine because for longer events like this, you can keep him as Final Form Frieza for a while, and he'll be stacking defense for a long time, right? Okay, so we took, we took 11k for a super there, that's not bad at all. Uh, super, 3.5 million. That's really good. That's really good. Okay, so like I, like I was saying, for shorter events, you keep him as Final Form Frieza for a couple of appearances, you stack that defense, become really tanky, and then you can pop that Golden Frieza active skill when you get to the later stages, right? Or for shorter events, you can literally just pop that active skill immediately. There's something on my face, hold on. Like out of the corner of my eye, I saw like a little like fluff. I don't know if you guys saw that, but it was bothering me. Anyways, um, for longer events, literally pop that active skill immediately on the first appearance and just tear through everything, right? So for the purpose of this video, we're gonna do a few rotations as Final Form Frieza because I wanna see how high that defense gets after a couple of supers. But uh, of course, for shorter events like certain Dokkan events or you know whatever, at your, uh, whatever event you're running where there's not that many turns, uh, just transform on turn one, watch that beautiful uh, animation for his transformation, and then he will annihilate the enemy because he hits really, really hard as Golden Frieza. But even as Final Form Frieza, as you can see, he's still doing some good damage. And this this dude, you overall actually, this unit overall actually does like almost everything. You know, he uh, raises defense on his super. He gets more attack and defense after being attacked. He uh, lowers the attack enemy's attack and defense. He has an active skill. He can massively raise attack on his super as Golden Frieza. He can seal the enemy. He can dodge after taking a hit. So I think I think after he takes a hit, he has a medium chance to evade enemy attacks too. So he has that going for him. Um, what else is there? I, I feel like there's more. I feel like there's stuff I'm missing. But um, the point I'm trying to make is like this Frieza really has it all. You know, like there's really no flaws in his kit in my opinion. And uh, he's just super easy to use. He's a super versatile unit, as I said. And I feel like right now just talking about him is convincing me that he is the new best TUR in the game, honestly. Like, I, I still think Tech Transforming Gohan is number one at the moment. But honestly, over the next couple of days, I, I, I might come to the conclusion, you know what, maybe by tomorrow. Like right now, it's li really late. It's like 2.30 in the morning. I'm making this video like a little bit after the data download came out because I want to get it to you guys as soon as possible. So my brain is like not all here right now. I should go to sleep as soon as this video is over, but I uh, probably will actually. But uh, the point I'm trying to make is I can't think clearly at the moment, but I feel like when I wake up in the morning after I have some dreams about Frieza and, and Gohan and Cooler 
like, I probably won't do that. Ah, who knows, man? I don't remember what the point I was trying to make was. Uh, <laughs> the point is, the point is, um, I think after some thought, after sleeping on it, I do believe that I will come to the conclusion that this Frieza is the best TUR in the game. Yo, look at that. Already 277,000 defense um, after how many supers? Two or three supers, right? Maybe two. I lost count. How, how, how many turns have passed? Five turns. Okay, so this would be the third appearance. So after two supers, he's up to 277,000 defense. That is really good guys okay so the question is do we pop, do we pop the active skill right now um or do we wait a little bit nah screw it okay let's pop it oh hold up let me turn up the volume here okay okay there we go enjoy <laughs> Dude, so good, man. That is, that is easily the best transformation animation in the game. All right, even better than Cooler, even better than Gohan, even better than um, anybody else can name, man. Uh, I may, maybe it's on par, I think, with the STR Namek Goku. But even then, I think he might have Namek Goku beat, man. Namek Goku was number one for transformation animations for me for the for the longest time but i feel like the frieza might have him beat i don't know i think about it i think about it okay so um the damage now should be much higher or at least a little bit higher we'll see he definitely does hit harder as golden frieza um the question is how much harder okay so we're taking a super here probably won't hurt too much 200,000 defense is still a lot yeah 131 and Oh well, damn, 5.58 million, okay, okay, and tanking really, really well, of course, no surprise there, um, I, <laughs> man, it's tough for me, because I love tech transforming Gohan so much, but I think, I think I might have to give the title, I think I might have to give the title, take it away from Gohan, and give it to to Frieza. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think? Because I have a hard time giving these titles away on the initial videos. Because I just feel like it's too early. It's too soon. I, I need to use these units in more situations. I need to uh, just have some more experience with them. But at the same time, with this guy, like his, his kid is not that. It's it's not that um, complex, right? It's actually a very simple kit. He's very easy to use. He's very intuitive and he's just amazing he's just insane um so i don't feel like there's really much else for me to see for me to test right like he's just fantastic no matter what event you can pop that active skill immediately of course you have less defense but um for shorter events you don't need as much defense i guess and for longer events he's just gonna be stacking that that defense for a long time we got to almost 300,000 almost 300,000 after like two supers imagine if we let him you know keep going for like four five six supers right like that defense would be sky high right he would be untouchable after a little while so I'm I'm overall very impressed with this unit man I love how versatile he is I love how um hard he hits like he does a lot of damage let's see let's see yeah it's over six million there you go easy easy casual over six million that's that's lr numbers and that's like now lr numbers it's not like old lr numbers like that's insane that's the only word i can use i know that word is like overused i know i know people say insane a lot but that is really the only word that can be used to describe this freezer right now and uh man jp players enjoy him for now um global players will get him probably sometime next year I'm, I'm guessing like early next year maybe january february something like that but uh regardless regardless where both you know both sides are going to be getting him it's just a matter of when exactly and uh jp players are going to get him in a couple days i believe on the 5th or 
fourth or fifth, I forgot actually, but in like two or three days after this video drops, his banner will be available. Hopefully it's a good banner, we'll see. Nobody really knows what that looks like right now, but I'm guessing Cooler is going to be on there. I'm guessing Metal Cooler is going to be on there. You know, Int, Angel, Golden, Frieza, some obvious inclusions, but uh, aside from that, we'll have to see. It doesn't really matter though, I don't care what the banner looks like. I will have to summon for this Frieza when he drops on the global side, because um, he's just that good. <laughs> It's, just, it's the same thing with Gohan, like Gohan's about to drop on uh, Global right now, or you know, like very soon, and uh, I, I, I was like, I don't care how much it costs, I don't care how many stones I have to spend, I must have this man, and this Frieza is in that same category now. Look at that, look at that tanking. Oh, look at that tanking. Damage off the charts too. Really, really impressive, man. That is 5.5, 6 million is nothing to... To, to scoff at, nothing to be ashamed of. And uh, defense is amazing too. And also, after he falls below, after you, your team falls below 50% HP, I believe, he gets 50%, or is it 49%? I forgot, but yeah, I think it's like 50 or 49% HP, you will get 50% damage reduction, which of course is obviously, that's like when you need the tanking the most. Right, that's when like that will come in most handy because you're about to die if you take a super on like you know extreme super battle road or something like that, right? So in that case, he's gonna be an even better tank, and uh, he can save your butt in some of those harder events like super battle road, extreme super battle road, all that good stuff. Okay, so we are about to get super here. I think we might die actually. I wasn't paying attention and I left Turtles there. That was a mistake. We're dead. Okay. Well, there you go. Anyways, that 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 was gonna be the showcase. I was gonna end it up like the next turn, anyways. So the the game just cut it off for me, like a minute early. But uh, it's all good. It's all good. You guys have seen all you need to see about this Frieza. Uh, once again, let me know in the comments down below what you guys think, because I am very impressed. I, I I honestly think he is the best TR in the game now. I'm gonna just say it, man. I don't like to say it usually in these videos, but. I, I gotta call it, I gotta call it as I see it, and uh, this Frieza is the new best TUR in the game, okay? So, let me know what you guys think about that, give me your opinions in the comments down below. Um, yeah, can't wait for him, can't wait. There's the showcase, guys, thank you so much for watching, hope you guys enjoyed it. As always, if you liked the video, then make sure to like the damn video, and... If it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button. To join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.